Tony, how spectacular would you say Kyle was today? Well, I think that today is one of the days the lion tells a story. Yeah. No runs to it. It's a real good assortment. It was handled beautifully by Yachty. Command was real good. Never really got, uh, you know, concerned that the office wasn't clicking after adding we were couldn't add runs. I didn't bother them. Got a big number. Bottom of the eighth. I didn't bother them either. When you see Kyle work with as many pitches as he had going today, do you, do you think that's a guy who is enjoying being healthy, or is part of it you think showing this is what I can do when I am healthy? Well, our memories are not aren't bad. We've seen Kyle like this. I mean, this is a guy who won 15 games for us. So I think he's just pleased he's going out there with weapons to compete that gives him a you know, fair chance. I mean, he's been going, going out there less than his best and taking his beating at times. So I think he just enjoys having a fair chance. you like how the offense kind of operated with what it was given today? I mean Take a well, lot of I, I think you got to give Gores Line a lot of credit. I mean, you know, two outs, nobody on, you know, clutch walk and a big home run, and we kept working. We knew it. You know, you can add something there, makes it tougher because Kyle was on time, just couldn't get anything going. So, I mean, I think they really pitched well. Were you going to give him that <laughs> after they hit by pitch? Uh, well, I was just, you know, you just. Had Miguel throwing early, then you had Miguel and and Trevor. Just gonna watch the inning, but he, I mean, he'd already pitched. I mean, you certainly don't want to spoil it, but I think that this is some kind of movie with a Hollywood ending, you know. And just some, if it looked like he was, it was all getting away from him, he was gonna have a quick hook. But you know, the first guy <clears throat> he didn't want to hit him, but after that he made no more mistakes. That's the holiday. The holiday that was. After the first couple of months last year, this is the same holiday that we've seen since then. Basically. His whole career. I mean, he's just one of the best hitters, you know, of our time. Productive. All over the ballpark, left field or right field. How relaxed did you, did you see it? this whole season? How relaxed has he been outside from the hospital? I mean, I, <clears throat> you got to ask him that. I, don't, <clears throat> I just know he. He knows he's talented. He knows he works hard, and he expects to do well. You get the runs tonight off today off home runs. This team also showing different ways to score. Uh, the long well, ball with hits. You're gonna have to score a lot of runs that aren't home runs. I'm gonna see David. You know, had a kind of tough afternoon. He stuck in there and threw a double there. <clears throat> score mad in the in the eighth. Uh, most of your runs are gonna be scored by creating rallies and moving guys around and getting them in. So. But we do have some pop to so take, take everything we can get. One of the things you said, though, is you like the variety of ways this lineup can kind of go about it, go about the offense. We kind of had to in this series. Their, their pitching wasn't allowing much. So. Yeah, I mean, it's just this is the big leagues. You're going to face a lot of days where, you know, it's not easy to crank out extra base hits. Still got to score runs. What's Kyle's potential now that now that he's healthy, feeling good, playing good? What's his potential for this? <coughs> well, I, you can never. Uh, I don't think anybody, unless you got a crystal ball, can say his his potential is this number of wins. But he's a really dedicated pro. He's going to work hard in between starts. He's in the same mold as the great ones that we've seen here and have here. You know, Carp, Wainwright, and you know, I go back to Daryl and and you know, you going to go on Todd's, Andy. Uh, Matt, I mean, Woody, these guys work. So when they get to the end of the year and they're still throwing the ball well, it's a product of hard work. And when you do that, you know, if the club gets some runs and plays, makes some plays, that Kyle's going to do his part. And then we'll see what the numbers are. And for a guy who's, who's been high, he's experienced his lows, he's experienced the injuries, um, you're rooting for a guy like that to succeed, right? Well, I was rooting for him before he got hurt. So, I mean, it's... I just think it's uh, human nature. You hear it all the time when somebody gets gets something taken away from them, and you have a, another chance at it. Boy, you you get a, you get a taste of it, and uh, not that you needed it, but it, maybe some guys need a wake up call. 
I mean, Kyle did not, but he appreciates, like I said, going out there, it being a fair competition. Tony, back to Holiday, when he was out, the appendectomy and the offense was struggling a bit. Did you know in your mind it was just a matter of getting him back because he's such an important piece to the, the whole middle of the order there? Well, if you watched him all spring, I mean, he's in the best shape of his life. Uh, he's in prime of his career. I mean, ball's just jumping off his bat all over the place. Um, you know, and the other day we played without Lance, and you know we didn't crack it open. We did play without Lance in LA one day and score some runs, and we can score runs without Matt. I mean, we we got a we got a deep roster. So, in Matt's case, you know he does a lot of things to to be productive and, and stay productive for as long as we play. Is this a routine day off for Berkman today? Mm -hmm. Yeah, doubleheader yesterday. I'd, this has been a night game. Could have played. You guys start two and six. You're now over 500, a piece of first place. I mean, you kind of look forward to measuring your club against one of the other clubs coming in here that's contending for the division. I don't look any more than I was looking forward to measuring against San Francisco or Arizona or L.A., Washington. Washington came in sweeping the Brewers. I mean, that's what this league's about. You get measured every time. That's the fun of it. You know, you, we go on the road. Houston was tough on us last year. You got Atlanta. I mean, this is that's why it's so much fun. As long as you get into the competition, which our club does. Visit for the first time, and this is a team that certainly you have. My thought is, we enjoy the moment. Talk about the Reds tomorrow.